Today, I'm joined by Asia Miller from the UMBC Women's Volleyball Program and our reigning setter of the week. First off, congratulations on such a fantastic week, highlighted by the conference's first triple-double in five years with 33 assists, 14 kills, and 17 digs this past weekend. You know, what was your mentality going into that match at Fairfield and trying to, you know, make a difference all over the court? I kind of just listened to what coach is telling me. That's kind of been my mentality throughout my four years being here, just like playing where I need to be played. Uh, luckily, I've been setting when I was in high school. I was setting in high school. And then my first year of college, I set as well. So it was still difficult to kind of transition back to that setter role and also the hitting role from uh, my sophomore year of college. But overall, I just try my best and just try to help the team as much as possible. What is it like to have a coach like Coach Casey who is really trying to empower you to do everything you you can on a court and give you that confidence to know that you can find a lot of different ways to succeed and help your team win? Funny thing is that I've never really been coached as a setter before. And luckily, Casey is um, was setter at Pepperdine. And so he knows the game really well in the setter mindset. And so he's been kind of uh, leading me, guiding me to that set of role as well, and helping me make good decisions, how to prepare when I'm setting, how to react and adjust. And so it's been really helpful. You are all, you're three and two right now. You played some tough matches. Those two losses were both very competitive matches. What has been working well for UMBC as a group right now? First of all, I would say like our game plan, our scouting, kind of how we go about that and having these film meetings as well with our coaches enable us to kind of apply it in practice and apply it for a pregame and in the game as well. Now you have some tough matches coming up over the next few weeks, including you get to host Princeton this weekend, and then you're going to Penn State the following weekend. How do you think these tests will help you and prepare you for conference play when you start that at the end of the month? Yeah, this our non-conference schedule is one of the hardest in the country, I believe. I mean, I'm so excited. I know all my teammates are excited to play these teams at this uh, high level. And we get a little rematch against Penn State from last year, so it'll be a fun. You know, for for you guys as well, you get to host these three matches this weekend. You know, what would you say to you know fans who may be undecided about trying to come and why should they come watch you guys and, and your exciting brand of volleyball? I think we're just gritty in general. Like we love playing the game. We try to play it to the best of our ability and um, our arena is amazing as well. We love the home court and we love the fans that come out as well. All right, Asia. Well, I appreciate you taking the time and best of luck this weekend hosting uh, some tough teams. Thank you so much. 